Bean Joe Green lines up at left inside linebacker and runs down South Houston All-State running back Bobby Allen after an eight-yard pickup. On second and two, number 72 Green stops the Tech fullback Bob Ammon for no gain. Third and two, and Joe is blocked by Tech's number 54 during a short game. With fourth and short, Joe lines up as a down lineman, a spot he is destined for greatness. But he tackles the wrong man as the Picadors get first down. Probably would have stopped the running back, number 47, Roger Truman. With Tech fourth and goal, left linebacker Joe Green, number 72, blitzes and disrupts the pass attempt and stops Tech at the eight-yard line. Well, here's Trooper Keaton, so Trooper, fill us in. Well, this one is a pass completion to Richard Black. That was what we were calling uh, Keaton, too. Catching the ball, makes a few moves there. But what's interesting is Richard Black was the individual that all week uh, they told me I was going to have to line up uh, against him. Be a quarterback for some reason, defensive end, a quarterback. But uh, what's really strange is like uh, 15 years later, Richard and I would play together on the Austin Texans minor league team. And uh, who would have thought our paths would cross 10, 15 years later? That's amazing. Number 92, yours truly, is out there at the strong side end. And I put a little pressure on the quarterback. Here I am again. Get a little piece of the ball carrier. We stop him anyway. Right here I am split out at the bottom of the screen. Against Richard Black, no less. Well, Richard runs around me, so I accomplished throwing him off his pattern. Then here I am split out again, playing cornerback for some reason. I bump him, and then here comes a... I thought it was a fullback and I gave him a form. Well, what, stop it right there. What I'm wondering is if the coach saw something. So the next play, the trap is set. You see me at the bottom of the play, lined up on one of the receivers, and I think that's Richard. So here we go. Get him off his pattern. Give that guy a form, knock him on the ground. I'm thinking, stop it right there. I'm thinking, my gosh, this is going to look good. I just knocked the receiver off his pattern, knocked some fullback down, but then what I see, the ball fly by, and I thought, oh, no, don't tell me. Then the flag flew by. Well, sure enough, that fell on knockdown with the receiver. But I'm thinking, my God, what's a defensive end doing playing quarterback? Right, right. So anyway, the next thing I know, and if you can tell by my mannerisms there, I knew I was on the bench right. after that. Sure enough, get him out of there. He's a walk-on. He just got his 15 yards. So that was my last play in the Texas Tech game uniform. Yeah, that's history. Yeah. <laughs> well, thanks, Trooper. The title of our video is Texas Tech's Trooper Keaton versus North Texas's Joe Green. Well, since we both played defense, uh, the fact of the matter is the closest I got to Joe Green was in the shower after the game. Uh, because there were so many freshmen, they overlapped into the varsity dressing room. And the reason I remember this, now we didn't know who Joe Green was. He's some, just some big old guy in North Texas. But my buddy Chuck Bullness was showering right next to him. And Bullness was like 6'4", 6 6'5", 6 235. And I'm sitting there looking at him. I said, man, that guy makes Chuck look small. Well, as history would show, Joe Green made a lot of guys look small. Now, I will come to one player's defense for the Texas Tech Picadors. Number 44, Bobby Allen. He gave Joe a run for his money. Now, I didn't, but Bobby did. Bobby went on later to go up to Philadelphia with the Eagles and have a cup of coffee. And man, he was there for a year or less. But uh, he played an outstanding game, and it should be noted. Bobby was offense and defense. And what's funny about Bobby is we. He was all state. You know, we just thought he was kind of a cocky guy. It wasn't until what it's been like uh, 40 years later, I go back and look at this film, Bobby's all over the place, playing offense and defense. Come to find out Bobby was a pretty good ball player, and he gave Joe a run for his money on that day. <laughs>